Okay, I'm gonna let you guess who this is. I bet no one's gonna guess who this is. But then I probably already put it in the in the thumbnail. It's Benji. Benji who came in like what? It was like shrunken almost, this big, and had just no weight on him. It was skinny boy, no hair. It was horrible. And look at him now. Look how gorgeous he is. It's just beautiful. And he was adopted. He was looking good when he was adopted, but I think he's looking better now. I think he's looking better now. Tracy, come talk to us about Benji. No, no. <laughs> You're being shy? I'm camera shy. <laughs> How's he doing? Oh, he's awesome. Yeah? Yeah. He's, he's great. He kind of reminds me of like if Chewbacca and, and a beaver had a baby. Right? He's just amazing. My oh, mom is sweet. absolutely in love with him. The whole household is in love with him. Oh, yeah. He's a sweetheart. His yeah. friend Jiz is in love with him. And he has t so much personality, this oh, guy, too. Because, you know, I actually wanted to keep him. And um, I, I couldn't. I was very sad because he wasn't really getting along with the Buddha boys. So that would have been the, the one, you know, if I would have kept him, that would have been the one thing that he needed to do is get along with the Buddha boys. And he didn't. So I'm like, ugh, you know. So I kept, I held, I held on to him for a long time, actually, because I didn't want to let him go. Like, no, he's not available. No, he's not available. And then... I, I, lost, know, I know I know Tracy she lost her baby and, and I know what a great guinea pig mom she is she's been adopting from us for a long time and I said uh, you know what I think I might have a really nice guinea pig for you so there you go you know it's very typical for guinea pigs to be misdiagnosed when it comes to skin problems this guy has a ringworm and what the vet will do, rather than just recognizing it on site, the vet usually will do a skin scraping and I dare say that 65-70% of those skin scrapings come back negative. It's uh, very common, they come back negative and you know it's a problem because a lot of these animals obviously you know the lab says it's not ringworm so okay it's not ringworm then what is it well maybe uh maybe it's mites so we're gonna treat for mites try that and then in the meantime a lot of time goes by and the animal doesn't get any better and i've had people come to me with with a guinea pig just like him saying the vet doesn't know what it is he doesn't know what to do um they are going to do steroid shots and we're going to do blood work and figure out. So, but I can't afford it. I've already spent like over $1,000 on this guinea pig and I've run out of money and you're my last, you're my last hope. Um, and that was just, wow, what a suffering, you know, over nothing. And, and I always say, treat for both. Just treat for both. Do the shampoo, do the ivermectin, you just knock them both out because sometimes it's hard to tell if it's one or the other because it can very well be both. You want a picture of his friend? You want a picture of his friend? Of his friend? His new friend? Sure. Okay. Sure. Let's see his new friend. Benji, I'm so happy to see you again. Yes, I am. He's so sweet. And your little chin rubs. You like those. Good boy. <laughs> oh, look at his buddy. So these guys are bestest buddies now, huh? And you want a little chinny rub too? You're not as chill as Benji. But yeah, he must have doubled in weight. I mean, in fact, I wouldn't mind weighing him for a second. Let's weigh him for a minute. Let's get my scale. Go ahead. So, okay, I found it. We have a big box of all the piggies that were adopted. And um, you came here in January, January 30th, with severe ringworm. Yeah, no, no joke. So he weighed 817 grams, which for an adult male is not a lot at all. It's very underweight. And I have a feeling he's, he's a lot more now. So let me put this away and I got my scale here. Let's turn it on. And let's see for your final weight, buddy. Okay, let's see. You're gonna stand, stay on there. A whopping 1,285 grams. 
<laughs> That's great. <laughs> In fact, let me write this down. <laughs> 285 on September 11. Wow. Wow. That's a lot. That's 400 grams. That's a lot. So, there, you're a good boy. Well, thank you so much again for oh, taking such you. good care of my little guy. Thank you for He's bringing him over for me too. to see him. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Mm. I love you, love you. I love him. Mm. He's a good boy. I do. I love you so much. Nice poopy. Good job. <laughs> All right. I just wanted to share with you my little Benji and how well he's doing. So big success story, this little guy. Thanks for watching.